I don't know about those videos, but out in the great outdoors. Today we're at Yo Fukuji Temple, or the remains of Yo Fukuji Temple. And that's the pond there. Across in the far distance are some foundations. Uh, we haven't built them yet, so we've got to go there for a minute. Um, but we've just completed a walk, a hiking trail from Kitakamakura Station. So we're in Kanagawa Ken this week. And where have we been? Which mountain did we travel to? Ohirayama. Ohirayama, okay. And how tall was that? Just for the folks at home now, how tall we've climbed today? 159. 159 metres. Um, is that about 450 feet, maybe? Uh, not the highest mountain, but it was still, still a bit of a challenge. Okay, today, of course, it's break time. Um, we've got our tea. Today, it's uh, Rington's traditional tea. And very nice it is too. Um, and today we've also got, I brought out some scones. Um, we've got our clotted cream and jam, so let me just make up. Would you like a scone? Yes, please. Okay. Got my clotted cream. Here's got my Marmite knife. And the reason we're having uh, cream tea down here is because there wasn't really anywhere on the mountain um, to take a break. Uh, so we've had to wait until the end to have a cup of tea and a scone. Don't let that put you off. The walk was actually uh, quite interesting. Uh, we went past a couple of Japanese uh, temple uh, shrines. That's right. Temple. There are temples, not shrines. Temples. What's the difference? <laughs> right. uh, the water is actually quite interesting. Um, uh, we went past a couple of temples. Uh, walked through a temple. It cost us 500 yen each. Um, and then there was a one area, secret area, uh, that number two found for us. Um, and some pictures I'm going to show you there. I don't know if you can see them, but. Um, so basically these caves carved into the rock where the layers had come down and into the caves which had been carved um, they'd actually uh, put figures a kind of burial site uh, and apparently it's from the Kamakura period which would make it about what 800 years ago Kamakura? Might need to check that <laughs> um, Okay, so we're from the Kam Kamakura period um, and actually, in this, your Fukuji is also from, uh, was built in the year 1200. Um, so that pond's possibly been here for 800 years. Okay, okay I think that's gone, ready. Is that one yours? Okay, let me in. Okay, that takes the dishes, of course. A little bit more tape. Okay, well as well as the scones and the clotted cream and the jam, um, I've also got a jar of this stuff, which a customer brought back um, from England a few weeks ago as a present. Uh, thank you very much. It's a jar of Marmite Crunchy Peanut Butter. Um, and I've got my crackers, um, so we're going to give it a little taste. Now, I'm a big fan of Marmite. Um, I do love Marmite on toast. Uh, Marmite Peanut Butter. It's a new experience for me. Do you want to try some? I'm not sure if there's the best serving suggestion, um, but peanut butter on crackers. Um, let's give it a test. Mm. You can taste the marmite in there. Not bad. Okay, that's me pretty full. Um, just to mention that Kamakura at the moment is featured um, in a major NHK historical drama shown on Sunday evenings, known as the Tiger Drama in Japan. Um, the title is Kamakura Dono no uh, Ju San Nin. Um, and I think part of it is featured around this area or the places we've been today. Um, so there are many people, surprisingly, um, for a quiet afternoon. Okay, well, until next time, hope you enjoyed that. Goodbye.